South Korea turned down a North Korean request to hold military talks. A defense ministry official says it is not appropriate to have the discussion now. North Korea made the offer to hold the talks this week before they tested missiles on Wednesday. We have decided to delay general-level military talks with North Korea on July 7th at 10 a.m. at the northern side of Panmunjom Tonggilgak due to North Korea's missile launch. The military talks are aimed at reducing military tensions between the two Koreas, which technically remain at war. Colonel Moo also says South Korea will notify the North of a date for military talks at an appropriate time. We expressed our strong regret over North Korea's execution of the missile launch. They had requested talks with us and we said we would contact them at an appropriate time regarding the date of the talks. South Korean officials say they will have to reconsider cooperation with the North after this incident. Meanwhile, Japan is remaining on high alert for yet another North Korean missile launch. A Pyongyang official told visiting Japanese journalists on Friday that bilateral relations between the two countries are at an all-time low. Nowadays, relations between Japan and North Korea are worse than the worst. It is plunging into a face-off stage. The envoy says that relations with Japan are even worse than its ties with the United States. So also warned Tokyo that Pyongyang is ready to take countermeasures if it is further pressured by Japan and the United States. North Korea has been saying that any imposition of sanctions would be equivalent to war. Tokyo has responded with harsh words on Pyongyang's latest remarks. I am feeling indignant about his remark. I ask him to reconsider who is the one who sowed discord between us and created the current tense situation.